Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. Today in this video we are going to take up another challenging question from Olympiads. We have to evaluate 1 over x plus 2 over x square plus 1 over x cube. If x is given to us 1 plus 6th root of 2 plus 6th root of 4 plus 6th root of 8 plus 6th root of 16 plus 6th root of 32. I will showcase two approaches basically. So let me write here method 1 or approach 1. And here I will consider our x as 1 plus 6 root of 2 plus 6 root of 2 is square. It is 4 plus 6 root of 2 cube which is 8. 6 root of 2 power 4 which is 16. And 6th root of 32 we will be writing 2 power 5. Now I will write one powerful exponent property. It is a power b whole power c. We can write any time a power c whole power b. So our expression will become x equal to 1 plus 6th root of 2 plus 6th root of 2 whole square. Then we can write 6th root of 2 whole cube. 6th root of 2 whole power 4. 6th root of 2 whole power 5. Now we will use our substitution. Let us consider 6th root of 2 equal to suppose a. So x will become 1 plus a plus a square plus a cube plus a power 4 plus a power 5. Now I will use algebraic expansion identity. It is, let me write here, a raised to the power n minus 1. We can write any time. It is a minus 1 times a raised to the power n minus 1 plus a raised to the power n minus 2 plus dot 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 up to a and last term will be 1. Once I will expand, once I will multiply these two brackets, we will only left this a raised to the power n minus 1. So I will use this identity straight away. So I can write a raised to the power 6 minus 1. This will become a minus 1. In other bracket, we will be writing a power 5 plus a power 4 plus a cube plus a square plus a plus 1. Now, you see this is our x. So, I can put here our substitution a. a was 6th root of 2. Let's put this value. So, I will be writing here 6th root of 2 whole power 6 minus 1 equal to 6th root of 2 minus 1 and here I will write x. Now, 6th root and power 6 will be over. So, left hand side it is only 2 minus 1. Right hand side we can write it is 6th root of 2 minus 1 times x. So, left hand side is 1. 6th root of 2 minus 1 times x. So, from here we are getting x is equal to 1 over 6th root of 2 minus 1. This is our x. Now we have to evaluate the expression. See this is our required expression. So let us take reciprocal of this. I will be writing here 1 over x. This value will be equal to 6th root of 2 minus 1. Now I will take this minus 1 to the left. So it will become 1 over x plus 1 equal to 6th root of 2. 
Now I will consider two things. I will write whole square and whole cube. Let me write here 1 over x plus 1 whole square. Then I can write this expansion equal to 1 over x square plus 2 over x plus 1. Okay, a square plus b square plus twice ab equal to 6th root of 2 whole square. And you will write like 2 raised to the power 1 over 6 times 2. So it is left 2 raised to the power 1 over 3. That means cube root 2. So let me write the conclusion. This equation I will write here. 1 over x square plus 2 over x plus 1 equal to cube root 2. Or we can take this plus 1 to the right. So this will become 1 over x square plus 2 over x equal to cube root 2 minus 1. Let me call this is equation number 1. Now I will consider cubing of the same equation of this equation. Okay, so I will be writing here 1 plus x plus 1 whole cube. a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube. This will be equal to 6th root of 2 whole cube. Similarly, I will write 2 raised to the power 1 by 6 times 3. So it is coming out a square root 2 only. So from this equation, I can write our second equation. It will be in terms of 1 over x cube plus 3 over x square plus 3 over x and this plus 1 I will take to the RHS so I can write root 2 minus 1. This is our second equation. Now I will take away first equation from second one. Let's write this. So I will write here equation 2 minus equation 1. So I will be writing 1 over x cube plus 3 over x square plus 3 over x. And then I will be writing 1 over x square plus 2 over x. In right hand side, I need to write square root 2 minus 1 minus cube root 2 minus 1. Now you can see I will write like terms all together. So I can write 1 over x cube then 3 over x square minus 1 over x square. So it will give us 2 over x square. Now 3 over x minus 2 over x. So this will give us 1 over x. So right hand side if you will see it is square root 2 minus 1 minus cube root 2 plus 1. So this will be over. We will have our final answer square root 2 minus cube root 2. And this is our expression. Now let us talk about method number 2 or approach number 2. So approach number 2 where we will use GP to solve this given x. How it is? See x is equal to 1 plus a plus a square dot 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 up to a power 5. Now I will write our first term. First term in GP we used to write a. First term equal to 1. Common ratio we used to write r. It is a. And total number of terms, if you will see, it is 6. So, formula, general formula to evaluate sum or x equal to 
a r raised to the power n minus 1 over r minus 1 and where r is common ratio so r equal to 6 root of 2. Now I can write see a equal to first term it is 1 this value in bracket I will write 6th root of 2 power is 6 n is 6 minus 1 over r minus 1 6th root of 2 minus 1 see 6th power and 6th root we will cancel so it is 2 minus 1 over 6th root of 2 minus 1 which is same as method 1 now after that we will use the same steps which we had in method 1 so this is minus 1 so i can write here negative 1 and see this value of x is same as the method 1 so we can use finite gp summation formula i hope this will be helpful to you friends do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck and take care of yourself